Hi everyone, I'm Claire Curry, Science Librarian at OU Libraries. Today, in video 18 of Options for Remote STEM Research, we're going to discuss giving credit with attribution statements. So in the previous video, we talked about what a license is and gave you some places to read about common licenses. Now that you know what a license is, how do you correctly give credit to the creator? Let's go to our Data Resources Research Guide at this link. In the box titled Understanding Licenses, you'll see a header called Attribution. The first two are examples of Creative Commons license attribution. In particular, there's an attribution generator where you can put in the title of the work that you're using and how you're using it and get an attribution statement out. The next two links are examples for software licenses. If you recall from the previous video, software and data have different needs from Creative Commons, so that's why they often use different licenses. For software in particular, if you are uncertain, please contact the intellectual property office or a lawyer. Finally, the fifth and final link under the attribution header covers data licenses and gives several examples. For data licenses in particular, the license itself should suggest text that you need to include in your work as the attribution statement. Finally, if you're not sure, you can always contact the creator and ask. Today, we covered giving credit by attribution statements, and in our next video, video 19, we'll cover citation. Citation is a type of attribution, so these two categories overlap, but it's good to know the variations and what they imply. We'll have a live Twitter Q&A for licensing and citing datasets on July 10th from 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. Central Daylight Time. No registration is necessary, but you can go to libraries.ou.edu slash events. Finally, more videos in this series, as well as announcements about our live events and workshops, are available on Twitter and the Data Analytics Visualization and Informatics Syndicate with serve. You can view past videos in this series at bit.ly slash OUSTEMYT. Please contact me if you have any questions or comments. Thanks for joining us and stay safe out there.